ever feel like you're just going through the motions of life without truly believing in yourself or your ability to live out your dreams. It's a common problem in today's world where many people simply accept their circumstances and fail to fully engage in life. But here's the thing, we are all in the same boat and it's up to each of us to actively participate. You may think that you're just an ordinary person with no extraordinary talents, but I guarantee you have at least one gift from God within you. It could be strength, speed, driving skills, singing, or even the ability to never miss. When you swing a hammer, you are put on this planet to master your unique art and share it with the world. But how do we turn these dreams into reality? The key is to set actionable goals that will lead us toward our aspirations. Life is like a game, and the most important player is our mind. When we master our thoughts, we can make them work in our favor. You might not be rich and successful today, but I believe that if we examine your habits and abilities, we can identify what is holding you back from wealth and success. We can then determine the value you can provide to the world, and that will ultimately decide your income. Yes, you have the power to decide your own income. Just look at those who have achieved immense wealth. They were not chosen by some divine force to be billionaires. They worked hard, earned their success, and so can you. Why should someone else deserve a billion dollars? While you don't, it simply doesn't make sense. Their path may have been easier, but that doesn't mean it's impossible for you. Anything is possible if you believe in it. There's a book called You Become What You Think About, and that statement holds so much truth. Thinking is the one thing we can always do. It's impossible not to think, because even not thinking is still thinking about not thinking. It's a paradox, but it's the nature of our minds. So how do we use our minds to our advantage? The secret lies in what we give to the world, because it always comes back to us. If you donate one million to charity, your company might make a billion in profit. Good things tend to come back around. God wants you to be healthy, wealthy, happy, and free. It's up to you to make sure that becomes a reality. God has provided us with the insight we need to live our best lives. So believe in yourself, recognize your gifts, set those actionable goals, and watch as the world opens up to you. You have the power to make your dreams come true.